What happened to my new there keyboard? You are. What's going on? <clears throat> Your face hey, is so hey, soft. Out. I'm not dreaming this time. Right? I hope not. It took forever to find you. Riku. <laughs> Wait a second. Where's Kyrie? Isn't she with you? Well, don't worry. I'm sure she made it off the island too. We're finally free. Hey, she might even be looking for us now. Swiggy swooty, I'm we'll coming for that booty. Don't worry. Just leave everything to me. I know this. Leave it to who? Sora, uh, what did you? I've been looking for you and Kyrie too, with their help. <coughs> <coughs> who are they? <laughs> we visited so many places and worlds looking for you. Really? Well, what do you know? I never would have guessed. Oh, and guess what? Sora is the Keyblade Master. Who was a giant? <clears throat> What's that mean? So, this is called a Keyblade? Huh? Uh -huh. Hey, give it back! <laughs> Catch. Whoa! Okay, so you're coming with us, right? We've got this awesome rocket. Wait till you see it. Mm -hmm. No, he can't come. What? Forget uh -huh. us. Oh, come on. He's my friend. I don't care. Oh, he's gone. Riku? Nice going. <clears throat> oh, well. At least he's okay. And who knows? Maybe we'll run into Kyrie soon, too. I really need to turn those notifications off. Eventually. Eventually, I'll remember to be a competent Let's Player. But for now. Alrighty. You, you guys ever hear of Maleficent? Come on, I hear she's in town. Who is she? A witch, man. She's a witch. She's the reason this town is full of heartless. <clears throat> Don't take her lightly. She's been using the heartless for years. We, we lost our world, thanks to her. One day, a swarm of heartless took over our world. That was nine years ago. I got out of that mess and came here with these guys. That's awful. Our ruler was a wise man named Ansem. He dedicated his life to studying the Heartless. His reports should tell us how to get rid of the Heartless. Where is this report? We don't know. It got scattered when our world was destroyed. I'm sure Maleficent's got most of the pages. <clears throat> you see, it's just as I told you. While you toiled away trying to find your dear friend, he quite simply replaced you with some new companions. Evidently, now he values them far more than he does you. You're better off without that wretched boy. Now think no more of him and come with me. I'll help you find what you're searching for. Uh, sure. Whatever you say. <laughs> so, you delivered that book. That navigation gummy's installed and ready to go. You find another one, you bring it to me. I threw in a warp gummy for the heck of it. Alright. There we go, now we don't have to keep doing gummy routes to return to levels. Now you can jump to worlds you've been to before. Well, better get back to my real job. What's my real job? You'll see. See me at the first district. 
I've been thinking about the bell in the in the second district. The one that rang a bit ago? The one above the gizmo shop. It's a freaking turt. There's a legend about it, you know. But it's all boarded up. No one can get in there. Heck, go check it out. Ring it three times and see if anything happens. Alright, whatever you say, crazy old man. Alright, I'm not gonna buy a rookie. There is something I do need to go do down here. Get Thunder ready. Come over here. Cast Thunder on that. I promise I'll let you hear this whole song in just a minute, because I'm going to need to fight some enemies pretty soon. It's a freaking church! <clears throat> Alright. Now I'm going to have to fight some enemies. whole gauntlet of them, and this time there's even more than there were before, even though I didn't come in here before, but still. Oh, the healer enemies, make sure you take those things out before you go after other enemies, especially the big ones that have the, that you know, go into rage mode when their health is half empty. <laughs> oh, I didn't get to the good part yet. Oh well. Alright, step on that. And that. And there's one more up here. Country music is really loud out there. I hate country music. <laughs> Alright. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. I just heard a whistle a few seconds ago, by the way. That's a new one. Wow, someone went really crazy with the sound design in here. Alrighty then. So you get two postcards just for screwing up their clocks. See, that's why flying enemies are annoying in this game. Come on. Alright, there we go. Excuse me. <coughs> Wake up, mofos. Time to come worship Jesus.
I'm getting interruptions about food, and I don't really care about food right now. Because I ate four slices of pizza for breakfast this morning, and I skipped lunch. I think I've mentioned this before, I almost never eat lunch. I mentioned that in my Psychonauts LP, actually. I'm actually getting a little hungry now, it's 4 o'clock. Come on. I've been recording almost an hour. Okay. <clears throat> Whoever's on that saxophone is good. World thing. It's really good. <laughs> oh, look who it is again, and your color is still gay. Alright, that's it. That's the boss. We're done. He's down for the count. We're, we're done. That's a whole third of the game done. It actually is. We're like a third of the way done already. And this is like, what, part 10 by now? Part 11? So yeah, we're doing this pretty fast. <laughs> <clears throat> Alrighty. This is actually a completely different beast right now. So it's actually, you know, flying and... You know what I've said about flying enemies already, they tend to be a bit annoying in this game. Come on. Sometimes Sora will leap into the air when you attack and sometimes he won't. Hold still. Still the same basic principle. And since I'm pretty overpowered here, this is really easy for me. Alright. That's all still what Simba can do. Hey, look, it's the intro! <laughs> Ow, that's cheap. Alright, so um, let's go up here. He won't be able to. Yeah, he will. Ah, oh, this is cheap. Gun. Okay. Ah, oh, and that's it. Well, if you fully charge it up, it's pretty powerful. There you go. I got some more. Is that HP or AP? I think it's AP. Probably the most useful magic spell in the game, especially when you upgrade it, because it'll actually damage enemies. But before you upgrade it, it's basically just a shield that reduces the amount of damage you take. Some people don't use it at all, but I find it very handy. Especially, especially against a certain boss toward the end of the game. You can cast it on all three of your party members and then just rapidly attack it and kill it really fast. I saw a, I saw a certain YouTuber do that in one of his, in his let's play of this game, but I don't remember that guy's name. So okay, I didn't get AP. I got HP. These guys got anything new? Nope. All right. <coughs> Alright. 
Oh, come on. There we go. <coughs> Alright, now if you talk to Sid, he'll tell you about how he runs a gummy shop where you can actually buy pieces for gummy ships. So, there's something you can do if you want to. I don't really bother doing it, though. Alright, we have one more thing to take care of before we move on. Well, well, <laughs> as I live and breathe, if it isn't Pinocchio. Oh, hi, Jiminy. What in the world are you doing down here? Mm. Playing hide and seek. Oh, I just don't believe it. And here I was, up all night just worried sick about you. Why of all the Pinocchio? That's gross. Okay. And he found drugs. <laughs> yeah, so this is basically, yeah. Telling him that his father's lost. Maybe I should have read this instead of just skimming through it. I've become really impatient. I don't know why. That's a good boy. <laughs> Alright. So basically, Jimmy is just telling him to stay put here while we hopefully go find Geppetto, but he kind of stole away, stole away on our ship anyway, so. <laughs> We'll be seeing more of that later. But for now, we've got one more thing we need, to, we need to take care of before we move on to the next world. Alright, we have a tournament to do. Now, this first tournament that we go to is actually pretty easy. The second, one, the second and third one are actually pretty difficult if you're not... If you don't, if you're not absolutely prepared for it, like you'll, I recommend making sure you have guard before you do the second tournament. So it'll help you out, help you out a lot. But for this first one, we're more than prepared. Trust me. And there's actually three modes you can do. First, you do enter together, and then you do enter alone, and then you do a time trial. And each one actually gives you a pretty good reward if you do all three of them. I'm not going to bother doing all three of them on cam on camera though, because it's it's not that it's hard. It's just you're watching the same thing three times. Uh, and if you're having trouble doing the time trial, just level up some more so that you can defeat enemies significantly faster. But other than that, you know, it's pretty easy actually. I did most, I did pretty much all of them on my first try. Even the Hades Cup, which you have to do in under 20 minutes. I managed to do that, I think, on my first try, so. And the Hades Cup is the final tournament, which is completely optional. Actually, I don't think you have to do all three of these. I think you technically only have to do the Hercules Cup, but I'm not sure. And you can't use summons here, unfortunately. <laughs> Wait, 
Yeah, so the pink ray color of guard armor that I was talking about earlier is going to be coming up soon. Is it pink or purple? I really can't tell. It's funny how the um, thunder enemies actually give you free XP when you kill them, because there's no element that's actually the opposite of thunder, at least in this game, so they just kind of give you free XP for the heck of it. Ow. There we go. That's the power of the keyblade. Like I said, take these things out first before you go for the um, large bodies. Because you don't want these guys to get healed, especially if you're not as powerful as I am. This song will get stuck in your head. It's in six of the games. So, I mean, come on, it's very easy to get this song stuck in your head. Ow. 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 <laughs> this is gonna be bad. Okay. I'm taking a lot more damage than I thought I would, but oh well. Last time I played for this game, I played it on standard mode, and that was only for the trophies, so. I guess I'm not quite used to this damage. I didn't want to target that. Ow. That's why I wanted to target the pink thing. And it's dead. Alright then. <coughs> and that's it. <laughs> Pretty easy. Gravity. I've heard a lot of people say Gravity Falls on Disney Channel is actually a pretty good show. I should check into it. Hmm. Uh, whatever. <laughs> oh, can't go to the world map from here for some reason. Time to dive into the warp hole.
wonder if I saw a laser in there. Oh, I was hoping the entire universe would explode. Oh well. Now I believe the music's about to change. Yep. Sounds a bit cooler now. Thank God. <laughs> Before I do this world, I think it's best if I go ahead and say what I've recorded so far, so next video we'll be starting on Agrabah. Toodles.